So look, I went from outreaching every single day and barely getting any replies to getting on around five sales calls in a matter of two weeks and getting my first 3K a month client within that very same week, just when I made a couple of changes to my outreach. So that's why in this video, I'm gonna break down exactly what I did so that you can go ahead and get your first copywriting client that's gonna pay you at least two to 4K every single month. Because I'll be honest, man, it's tough out there. You know, copywriting is a very, very competitive game and it seems now like everybody's trying to get into it and everybody's trying to replace their nine to five with their copywriting game. And I know how hard it is because I did pretty much what every other copywriter just starting out does. I basically focus on sending out as many emails as I could. So each day I would send at least 40 to 60 emails. Some days when I was really, really, really motivated, I'd go all day, like the whole weekend, and send like 80 to 100 emails in the span of a day on Saturday and on Sunday, just because I wanted to make it so badly. But what I didn't know is that it's not really about how much you do, it's more of about doing the right type of thing. So while a lot of other copywriting gurus and stuff out there will tell you, oh, well, it's just a numbers game, all you gotta do is send more outreaches and more outreaches and more outreaches, and eventually you'll land your first client. But here's what I actually learned from trying the old way and then how I came about discovering the new method that I'm about to show you that actually closed clients pretty much whenever I wanted like on command. So look, what most copywriters don't get and what most even seasoned veteran copywriters don't understand, even these copywriting gurus who don't really know what they're talking about, they don't really understand the concept of traffic versus conversions. Now, when I learned the difference between traffic and conversions and learned how you can use them together to actually close clients, my reply rate went through the roof. I started actually closing clients and I started getting deals that were actually good monthly retainer deals, not just like, you know, $50 for an email or $20 for an email here and there. They were actually good deals and I was getting responses from people who are actually pretty big in the niche that I was reaching out to. So look, the concept kind of goes like this, okay? In order to sell anything, you need a combination of traffic and conversions, all right? So let's say, for example, you have all traffic. All you worry about is traffic and you're trying to sell a product, okay? A product or a service. Well, that means that thousands of people are actually going to your, you know, your website or your landing page or whatever to go see your thing. But the problem is that it doesn't convert, all right? The value is not there or it's something that people don't really want. There's no product market fit. So if that happens, then you're not gonna make any sales because all you have is traffic, but you don't have any conversions. But on the other hand, let's say you have all conversions but no traffic, okay? Let's say you have the best sales page ever, the best offer, and if anyone were to see it, they would passionately just whip out their wallet and wanna pay you right away. Well, you see, if you don't have any traffic, if nobody actually goes to the page, then that means that nobody's still going to buy. So what you need is a combination of both. And the problem is that most copywriters that are beginners or even most of these copywriting gurus who are seasoned veterans, and don't actually know what they're talking about, uh, they'll tell you, you know, just more traffic. What you need is more traffic, more traffic, more traffic. But honestly, most copywriters don't have a traffic issue. They have a conversion issue, okay? So to further kind of demonstrate what I'm talking about, I've made you a whole diagram that I'll take you into right now and teach you exactly how it works. Okay, so here I have a diagram, okay? And this is you. Okay, or the average copywriter who's just beginning or anybody like that, right? Anybody who's really focused on traffic, let's just say, okay? And then of course, here's me, all right? I'm uh, completely jacked. Um, oh, so, sorry, one second, I actually forgot the six pack. Let me just, yep, yeah. uh-huh, there we go. That looks more like it. Okay, so there's you on top and then there's me right there, all right, with my muscles and Let's go, let's go through, see, see the outreach uh, numbers. So if you outreach 50 times a day, right? And I outreach 15 times a day, all right? Now, again, everybody's gonna tell you, oh, well, the guy who outreaches more is gonna get the more clients, but I'll show you exactly why that's you know not necessarily correct. So, so now if we go and keep looking, right? So let's say your reply rate is 1% and my reply rate is 30%, all right? Now, these are actually real numbers that I'm not pulling out of my ass, okay? So look, 1%, I, I used to literally get a reply like every other day that I do outreach, right? If that, right? Sometimes I go a couple days without getting a single reply, meaning that I was completely wasting my time, right? And that's one thing that you should not be doing, right? If you're trying to progress in this, your time is extremely valuable to you, especially if you want to progress quickly, all right? That's why, you know, I'm showing you guys how to get your first $3,000 a month client in a week 
which is what I literally did. And this is how I did it, right? So I used to be this guy up top and now I'm this guy down below and I literally had a 30% reply rate. Um, so while I'm only sending 15 outreaches, right, which is much less than you, I'm getting much more replies. So if we actually do the math on that, I get about 4.5 replies on a daily basis while I used to get 0.5 replies, right? So I'm literally getting nine times, I believe that is, right? If my math is correct, nine times the amount of replies that you're getting on a daily basis, right? And, and that's j just by doing that, right? Focusing on conversions, I outreach a lot less, right? So I take away from the traffic, right? Because that's what everybody is worried about. But guys, if you worry more about conversions, I promise you, I promise you, you will literally close so much more clients. It's not even funny. All right. And now, of course, that uh, that obviously expands to, you know, everybody who's focused about traffic, you you take in the Metro Transit to, to wherever you're going, probably your nine to five brokey job, eating ketchup sandwiches in your mom's basement. And of course, I'm going to be rolling around in my damn Bugatti. But don't be a metro transit type of dude you can be a bugatti bugatti type of dude if you just fix your conversion rates and don't worry about traffic so much so now naturally you're thinking well tyson okay i get it conversion is way better than just focusing on traffic but how do i actually do it well i'm about to reveal to you guys the highest conversion outreach strategy that i have come across today this is the one exactly one that i've used to actually close that 3k client and a bunch of my last clients right this is it works like a charm and the people that i've been teasing it to also say that it's been working really really well for them it's like a complete cheat code and i'm going to show you exactly how to do it so it's called the video intro method and all it really is is you message somebody on instagram with a hook right you just get them to reply first then they reply back to you and they say yo what's up and then you send a video of yourself basically introducing yourself giving them your offer and then asking if they'd kind of be open to discussing it further now i do have a couple of videos that i'd be willing to share with you guys um the link is in the description i actually put it in with the ultimate outreach playbook because a lot of you guys were asking for it i actually reveal a whole bunch of my outreach methods and the video will actually be included in there as a link now the reason that the video intro method works so well is one because nobody is doing it right? Nobody really likes to get on camera and speak or any of that, right? But I found through doing either the Loom video approach where I kind of just make an audit of their sales funnel or something like that, or the video intro DM, those are two of the best and highest converting outreach messages that you can really send. And while yes, it might take longer to actually do it that way and do the video intro method, that's the thing is that while I only outreach 15 times a day, and you're outreaching 50 times a day, I promise you I'm gonna close way more clients just because I'm focusing more on conversions, whereas you are wasting your time with traffic. So guys, I wish you all the success in the world on your client hunting journey. And if you guys want more effective outreach methods like this, I'm gonna put some videos on screen, which you can go and check out. All right, guys, that's everything for now. And of course, I'll see you guys on the next one.